we just joined a table at Mahjong time. In this strategy theory session, we're going to be playing American Mahjong using the National Mahjong League card. If you've not tried playing here yet, look for my email in the video description below. I can send you information about their 30-day VIP trial. Let me go full screen and let's check out these tiles. We have a pair of one bams and a pung of threes. I'm thinking little odds. We even have a three, five, and a one. So I probably would let the two crack go so we don't pass six, nine, and one suit. One, three, three, five, little odds. There's a hand right there. No gaps, second hand down on the left. No keepers. One, three, three, five. Here's a one, two, three building though. Anytime you have an opportunity to play consecutive run, consider it because it's a powerhouse with the built-in tile efficiency. It is a, it's an excellent category to focus on. And there are hands outside the category too that you could play depending on the tiles you get, of course. All right, we've got a keeper. Well, we have two keepers potentially, but they're going two different ways. We have one, three, three, five, second hand down, or one, two, three. Since uh, with the one, two, three, we could play the third hand down, or maybe let's see, one, two, three, four, fifth hand down, but we have no fours. I would let the two go and focus on little odds. That is a hand with no gaps. So if you have an option for two different hands, go with the hand with no gaps, just like this right here. One, three, three, five. We just got a three, which is not a keeper, not this year. Let's see here. We definitely want to keep going. Here's one, three, three, five. We don't need a Kong. And I don't want to pass like numbers either. So we're gonna let that three bam go. We need Pung Pung Kong Kong. Pung Pung Kong Kong. So we're having to let what looks like a, a great tile. Okay, now here is an interesting development. We picked up a four and a two. Oh, let's see, wrong two, right here. So now we have one through four, no gaps, which is far more efficient than one, three, five, so I'm thinking we'll see those other BAMs come back. Let's pass, let's see, we have, let's pass the three and see what happens. I'm thinking we're gonna get the twos back. There's one. So now we have just as much strength as we did with one, three, five, and we're streamlined with consecutive run. One, two, three, four, second hand from the bottom under consecutive run. Pung, pung, kong, kong. We're one away from being set on that four bam. I'm hoping we'll get the, the other two bam. I think there's another two bam out. It might be the same two though. All right, so now we just need to wait to see how many our opponent wants. Right now we have four discards, which is it's, it's not bad. We're a contender, I think, with four discards, but I'm hoping we'll get another opportunity to get a keeper. But our opponent is delaying their offer. It's good, I think, to be reactive. There we go. They want two. We can do two. Let's give them a south and a one. So we're playing one suit, one, two, three, four. No keepers. We have four discards and a hand with no gaps. I'd say we're a contender on this one. Northway. We can pung the one and the two. We can even kong the three. All we need is one good one pick for character. this four. If we get this four bam or a joker in the first, let's say, five picks, I'd say we can bump up to Tricks front runner. Bamboos. Okay, there's joker bait with a west. Let's keep it for a little while. Joker bait Northway. is ideal. If you discard one, it's 60 Six tiles characters. remaining. We're going to pass. Sounds so weird. I don't know if we're going to be able to get that pair all the way to 60 tiles remaining. That would be the middle of the game. Five characters. 
I will pass. A flower. Now that's interesting. Six characters. We can maybe switch to the third hand down in one suit. One bamboo. Okay, I, I think we're better off because we need a pair of flowers. I think we should go ahead and we could actually pass. That's the first one. There'll be another one. We could pass. Because if we get, let's say, a two bam, we could Kong and then Kong the three. Six I'm dots. still thinking that second hand from the bottom is best. Oh my goodness, we got a West. Five characters. That's not helpful. Let's see. Without an East. Let me see. One Six one dots. suit, multiples. Two Don't bamboos. I would not be distracted here. Okay, so two bam. We can we can let's go ahead and pung. Hmm. I don't want to wait any longer. We can let the West go. West win. So we could have waited on the two, but twos are a hot commodity. North win. This decade, <laughs> because we're in the South two, win. you know, it's 2024. There are two twos. Anybody playing a year hand, Five they're going to make it difficult to gather twos. So I did not want to wait on that two. Let's let the flower go. Flower. And then we'll let the dragon go. So now if the one bam goes down again, we'll call. And then we can Kong the three. Flower. We just need a little help with the four. And we are playing with year tiles here, two and four. Three dots. Let's hope nobody's playing a year hand because that could hinder us. Three bamboos. Okay, so let's Kong. Kong. White dragon. Now this is going to be telling. Oh. Everyone's going to know what we're playing with a Pung and a Kong like that. Last year, the hand, the first oh, consecutive okay. Ren hand could have been the shape for this particular hand. But this year, it's Pung, Pair, Kong, Pair, Pung. So we are playing the sixth, second hand from the bottom. We're going to discard this five. Second Pung hand from bamboo. the bottom on the left. One, two, three, four, Pung, Pung, Kong, Kong. And four everyone knows it. Okay, now that is our tile. We cannot call it. But this is a hand of least resistance, so we can use jokers. South Have no fear. If you're playing a hand of least resistance, even one joker will Four get us. Will, oh, shoot. There's our other one. Now we need two jokers. West wind. Nobody wants wins, it seems. So we're going to be on the hunt for jokers now. West wind. Three dots. West so wind. when one crack is out, no eight dots are out. We're at 66 tiles remaining. This is the middle of the game. Just about one more, one more round one of, of uh, picks from the wall. And we'll be in the very middle of the game. It's ideal Lower. to know what hand you're playing at this point. And we do. We're in a challenging position because one we character. need jokers. So I'd say... We're still a contender, but we need jokers. So one character. We have no vulnerability. We have work to do though. One character. And there are two ways to get jokers, either from the wall East or wind. in exposures. So we just need to be mindful of the tiles we're keeping Three and the dots. tiles remaining in the wall. North is a good discard. We're at 59 North tiles win. remaining now. We're still in the middle game. One dot. At about 50 tiles remaining is when you want to start holding safe discards. Red dragon. Right now, both of these are not out yet. And the idea there is to hold those tiles to maybe get an opportunity hmm. to do a joker exchange. Like if one of these were a red one dragon. Dot there would be a joker exchange although there is a red dragon right here let's see if we can draw a red dragon nine characters east 
east wind. Okay, so a pun of red dragons. They have a three, three and a white years. dragon in front. Oh, there's our tile. Now we're going to need two more jokers. Two bamboos. All three fours are out. Oh, that's sad. Nine. That's characters. okay. Have no fear. I need to remind myself of that. Four dots. We could obtain jokers just like everybody else. Eight bamboos. Okay, now there's a hesitation on the eight. And we're at 49 tiles remaining. We should probably let this eight dot go. There's a two dot. Nobody wanted the two dot. Two dots. <laughs> there we go. We need to start collecting safe discards. <coughs> Eight dots. So now we have that keeper there. We just need jokers now. East wind. We have one more pick in the middle game. Five dots. We'll be in the end game after this pick. With one discard. Six and the challenge dots. we have is that we need jokers. Hopefully we'll draw that red dragon. Let's see now. We need safe discards. Let's let the two go. That would be two a year dots. tile. The six bam, two are out. So that should be safe. Five dots. We want to try to have the safest discard possible in our hand. So we'll just continually swap Four it out dots. with the safest discard. Eight bamboos. Red dragon would be an ideal pick. And eight dot. Okay, eight dot. There's just one out. Eight dots. Eight dots. I wish there wow. were more exposures with jokers. Now here's, woo, that's a risky, that would be a, a, a red flag. Eight bamboos. Throwing a joker in the end game, or not a joker, that's a flower. Okay, we did get a joker from Six the wall. Bamboos. So now it'd be really nice to draw that red dragon. There's still one more left. Nine dots. And it would be kind of nice if these other players would make exposures with Five jokers, because then we might be able to get a joker that way. Red dragon would be ideal, Nine or dots. a joker, of course. A two crack. None are out, but we're going to throw it. We're ready to win. Two characters. How about an exposure? Kong. Okay, awesome. Pure Kong, that's good. Nine dots. Okay, red dragon, red dragon. A five bam. Okay, this is going to be a little, oh, one is out. Five bamboos. We threw it earlier <laughs> six characters okay so now red dragon that's what we want that's the only joker available for exchange right now nine bamboos okay our turn is coming up we want that dragon or a joker nine characters red dragon joker keeper a two dot we keep getting your tiles two dots Nine bamboos. Nine characters. Okay, here comes our turn. Joker keeper. Red dragon. Oh no, they got it. Oh, shucks. We were close. Eight characters. Oh, all right. How about a joker out of the wall? Kong. Ah, oh, we got skipped. Okay, now here. Let's see. Is that available? Nine yes, dots. the eight crack is available. Let's see if we can draw an eight crack now. The anticipation. Green dragon. Oh, the anticipation. Eight crack now. Three crack. Three crack. Uh-oh, none are out. Three characters. Mazzon. Oh, shucks. It was very difficult to know what they're playing. That was a fresh tile, though. But we're ready to win. We just needed a joker. Here they have two, three, four Kongs. I'm okay with that. We also were ready to win on a Joker. There was one up for grabs. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There was one Joker in the wall. So we did have some potential to get that Joker. 
Here we have like numbers with sevens. They have one discard, a risky tile, just like us. Here, six, seven, eight, single pair Kong, but they couldn't get the eight BMs. All right. We could have discarded a Joker, but look how many tiles are left. You have to decide, are you gonna play to win and accept the consequences or fold and discard safely? I opted to play to win. Lose with dignity, win with humility. That's the way to play Mahjong. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.